The comeback kid has finally been revealed, and three contestants were shockingly eliminated on Disney night. Plus, country boy Alex Miller is joining us and giving us his winner prediction on this week's recap. It was Disney night on American Idol, and we finally have a top seven. Yeah. Arthur Gunn won the comeback, which meant three other contestants went home. Cassandra Coleman, Deshaun Goncalves, and Alyssa, Alyssa Ray. Ray. What do you guys think about that? Let us know in the comments below if you were shocked. I kind of feel like it was a correct what happened with the three. Do you? I feel like America made the right decision. Me too. And also, Just Sam just also predicted that Arthur Gunn would make it through, and she said he'd win the show. And oh, we'll see if we'll that see. actually happens. But Disney Week was so fun. I loved all like of the our, magical things happening. Our hands. Yeah, we're you know Mickey Mouse, <laughs> Mickey Mousing up in here. But I feel like we have to get into the top three yes, performances. Let's do it straight away because they were amazing. And at number three, we have Casey, Casey Bishop. Bishop. So why did you like Casey? Okay, first of all, she looked beautiful in that red outfit, and I feel like when you do a song from Toy Story, you gotta do it big. And she did just that. I can't take you seriously with the hand. <laughs> all right, it's time for number two, Arthur, Arthur Gunn. Gunn. Yes, you know, it's really funny. He's grown on me. I, I was kind of bothered by them doing this, adding last season back to the season. Oh, I know. And <laughs> But he's actually grown on me, so he did a really great job, and so I think he deserves that position. It's kind of like deja vu saying that Arthur Gunn is the number two performance of the week, but honestly, he took Remember Me from Coco, which is like mm -hmm. an iconic song, and he completely remastered yeah, it. Yeah, he did. He did. And you said, you predicted he was going through. She did. She knew yeah. it. Yeah. And I also kind of predicted our number one performance, yep. Grace Kinsler. Yeah, that was awesome. Yeah, so before the show, when we found out Grace was getting the last spot and she was singing a song from Frozen, we immediately knew she was gonna have the best performance of the night. Yeah, truly, and she looked absolutely beautiful with mm -hmm. the gown that she had on, and then the notes, she just soared. So I, I thought she was phenomenal, and she deserves number one. And, you know, we're gonna throw a little, or I'm throwing a little special heart award in there tonight. Hunter Metz. That was not part of the, the script. <laughs> it was for me. I, no, let me tell you why. Okay, he gets the hard award, of course, because you know we all love him, and Billy has a love for Hunter. But also, did you see Katie? She was just watching him like... Just like you. <laughs> okay, you get the hard award, Hunter. All right, if you're going to get your honorable mention with Hunter, I feel like I should get an honorable mention too with the heartthrob, Chase Beckham, okay? Okay. Not only does he have all the ladies and Billy swooning, but... Um, <laughs> Why me? Why me? I see the way you look at him. Um, but we also oh, we just... We haven't been putting him in the top three as often as some of the other contestants, and I feel like he deserves it. He and does, but you remember my very first episode here with you, I said he was one of my tops, remember? Okay, well, Hunter has now taken that spot, but um, you know what was funny is that after Chase, Chase's performance, we saw Graham DeFranco yes. sitting in his living room. I know, what, what's going on with that? Graham is basically doing a tour, so we are hoping, Graham, that you are coming to Talent Recap next, yes? Yes, Graham DeFranco, if you're out there, please, please. <laughs> With our come, Disney hands. Come to us. But we gotta take the gloves off right. right now because we have a very special guest on this week's Talent Recap Show all the way from Kentucky. It's Alex, Alex Miller. Miller. Alex. Oh, hello. Hey, Alex. Oh, well, good to see you all. Welcome to the Talent Recap Show. We are so glad to have you on. Glad to be here. Glad to be here. Hope I don't cause too much trouble now. <laughs> um, well, first of all, we have been talking about how Graham DeFranco has been on a little bit of a tour, going from house to house on American Idol. But tell us, where are you right now? Well, I, I hopped on the Graham DeFranco train, and I'm, I'm at Alyssa Ray's aunt's house where we was watching tonight. So uh, it's uh, I'm, I'm watching Graham. I'm, I'm catching up now. <laughs> <laughs> how did that happen? You guys you just were friends during the show. You live nearby. How does that happen? Yeah, so I live about 30 minutes away, and then her mom's such a sweet lady invited me over, and so I got fed and I got to watch out. So that works good for me. Oh, that's awesome. That's awesome. <laughs> so so we want to get right into it and ask you some questions, okay? So do you think, the first one I want to ask, do you think that Arthur Gunn has a chance to win this show? Uh, Arthur doing so well last season will definitely help him on this one. Um, I, I, Arthur's an incredible talent, and uh, um, I, was hate, I hate to see my buddy Alyssa go home, but... Uh, 
think I think ours will do pretty well. Yes, sir. Okay. All right. So leading into our next question, which you kind of just answered, who do you think has the best shot of winning the show? Wow, that's a hard question. I'm I'm for all the contestants. Being a contestant, you got you got you can't really pick one. So I I can't pick a contestant. I'm just rooting all my fellow contestants out. All right. Okay. So if you can't pick one, can you give us a top three? Your prediction. Yeah, I can give you my predictions. I, I think Willie's going to do really well this season. I think he's going to be doing real well. And, and I think that uh, I, I like uh, uh, the Casey girl. I think she's going to do real well. And I also like Che. I like them all. Uh -huh. uh, so I would I would say Willie and uh, Chase probably has a good shot. I like the steel guitar on on the show tonight, so I was, I was enjoying that. Um, and and I'd say Casey, that's probably who I would uh, I'd keep uh, on the competition. It would be the top three for me. So we talked a little bit about Arthur, um, but we wanted to get your thoughts on the comeback. Do you think it's fair that Arthur could come on the show and possibly win the show? I think that. It, uh, it's definitely a little challenging. Uh, the last year has been a little difficult for everybody and uh, giving these contestants another shot, I don't see nothing wrong with it. Um, uh, hopefully they'll bring us back next year. That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. That would be great. We would love to see you back on, you know. Um, we want to ask you, so what, what were some of your highs and some of your lows when you did Idol? What, what was the best parts, the lowest moments? Okay, so we did filming of uh, Idol back in September and October, and, and uh, Hollywood Week was in December, if I remember the, uh, the dates right. So I got sent home in December, uh, and I had, to, had to, I had to keep that on my head and in my brain for about three or four months, and then it finally aired on television, and I could, didn't have to keep secrets no more. So that was, that was, that was definitely the lows. Never, I couldn't tell nobody anything. Uh -huh. But uh, uh, after the show was over, um, a lot of shows I'm getting to play now, and, and it's, it's so good to get back out and, and see people like I used to. So speaking of coming back next season, in the beginning of this season, I actually predicted that you were going to make it to the top five because I feel like every season we have that one country kid that just does really well on the yeah. show. And from your audition right away, I could just tell that you were special. And now we kind of only have one country kid left on the show. You know, we have Caleb Kennedy. So how do you feel about, you know, the lack of country on American Idol this season? I, I think that um, the country genre is, is uh, it's, it's, a little, it's a little challenging sometimes. There's so many great people in the genre and, and narrowing it down to, you know, one or two to represent any genre is tough. And uh, I, uh, I, I'm, I'm glad to see Caleb. He's one of my good buddies, so it was good to see him, him move on and, and doing so well. And uh, I, I think there is a, 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 they try to balance out as best they can and, and America voting is the first way to do it. So uh, I think Country's got a good shot. All right, so you came onto the show and you were on this journey trying to find love. <laughs> so we got to ask, um, did you find love with any of the contestants on the show or did you find love when you got home from the show? Oh, um, well, the, the contestant thing, I don't, I don't know if there's any love there or not. I'll just have to wait <laughs> see. Um, but I, I'm definitely finding some love when I got home. My county and all the people around us have been really supporting us. And I can't even go out and eat anymore. I went out with a couple of girls the other night. We went out to eat. I couldn't talk to girls for the people coming over and talking to me. So it was kind of a... Oh, that's great. Of, <laughs> a couple of girls. I know, a couple of girls. Alex. Yeah. Go ahead, Alex. <laughs> Okay, <laughs> that's we so <see> awesome. You. <laughs> and everybody's watching you now, so it's different, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Everybody's like, what's this turkey boy got going on? <laughs> so, speaking of romance on the show, a lot of people are wondering if there's any juicy relationships happening behind uh -huh. the scenes. So, will we be seeing another Gabby Barrett and Cade Vayner situation on this season of American Idol? I don't think you can have as cute a couple as, as, as them two. Um, it'd, be, it'd be really tough to top them. I, it really would be. So I, I'm, as far as I know, uh, everybody on the show is as single as me. So. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> well, ladies, if you're out there and you want to go out with Alex Miller, drop your comments down below because he's honestly, you're seriously so charming. Yeah, I'm truly. just like, wow, he's oh, awesome. Well, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> That's so great. And so we want to ask you also, did you do the thing with, with Luke, the Grand Old Opry? What happened with that? 
Um, I haven't got the date on it, but I know it's coming soon. So I'm waiting on my good buddy. I know he's I know he's got some tour dates coming up. So oh, hopefully we'll we'll get something in. I know he's a busy guy, and, and I'm starting to get busy too. So uh, we'll work it in as best we can. Absolutely. Well, we're going to remind him right now. Okay, Luke, are you <laughs> listening, Luke? You, you better. <laughs> <laughs> well, you just said that you're really busy. Um, I saw that you came out with the song that you originally performed on American Idol. You came out with that as a single. And I just I wanted to know like, what you're up to now, what you plan on doing, and if you ever plan on auditioning for American Idol again. It, it's hard to say. Um, I'm gonna see how this next, the next couple of years go as far as auditioning again. But I've been up, up to a whole heck of a lot. We've uh, we bought us a, a panel van, I guess you could say. So we're gonna be doing some traveling, and uh, I got us. Uh, I'm doing some more music. He's talking about the single, trying to put an album together and uh, get things ready for maybe some more releases. So y'all better watch out for that. Wow, that's awesome. So we see you have your guitar. Will you play us a little something? Yeah. I speaking of the single, this will be a good time to plug it. So uh, do a little. I'm over you, so get over me. Well, time and time again I try And just when I get you off my mind Well, you come crawling on your knees Bawling, crying, and begging, please But I'm over you, so get over me Oh, yeah, I'm over you Get over me. Yeah, that was awesome, man. Oh, man. I got little goosies over here. You better. You better. I put a lot of work in that thing. <laughs> oh, my God. It's so that good. That was so good. I'm like fangirling right now. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Okay. Wow. Well, we want to thank you so much for coming on. Is there anything else you want to tell us? Yeah, go out and play my song. Be great. I'd very much appreciate it. It's all over the place. So uh, go out and see me, and I uh, hope to see from you too. You heard that, guys. So go get his song, and also comment below what you think of the song, all right? Right. Yes, and show your love for Alex Miller because this guy <laughs> is just awesome. And thank well, you thank so you. much for coming on Talent Recap. I appreciate you having me. Y'all take care. Have a good time now, all right? Wow, he's so sweet. Like, that was awesome, right? I love him. I'm like sweaty <laughs> from watching that she's, performance. She's swooning over here from that performance. And, but he was, he was really great. And and I, I think that him doing the Gretel Opry is even better than him being on the show. Yeah, he's the, the real winner, if I, if I could say so myself here. But let us know down below, you guys. Keep dropping your comments. Or if you were shocked about anything that happened this week, if you agree with our top three picks, and if you think Billy is faking his enthusiasm. Um, <laughs> um, but I think that wraps up this incredible uh, Disney week. I'm going to kick your butt. But yeah, <laughs> there we go. Um, in the meantime, let everybody know where they can find you. <laughs> at Billy Blanks Jr. on all platforms. And if you want to follow me on Instagram, it's at SamanthaX373. And while you're on YouTube, you should hit the subscribe button and the notification bell. Follow Tower Recap on all social medias. And head over to TowerRecap.com because we have all the scoop on American Idol. <laughs> and I think it's time for us to say, and, and that's, that's our, our Talent, Talent Recap. Recap. Hey, what are you doing tonight? Well, I think you should hit that subscribe button down below and then we can talk.